The Office of Naval Research. Revolutionary research, relevant results. Energy plays a key role in the Navy's reach and the Navy's persistence. The reach lets us go where we need to go when we need to be there, and persistence lets us stay. This is critical for the Navy Marine Corps' contribution to national security. To a certain extent, we have ceded a strategic resource, one that is difficult to guarantee. This creates an obvious vulnerability to our energy security and to our national security and to our future on this planet. Warrior Power, ONR, Education and Energy. The Office of Naval Research is committed to the development of alternative energy sources for the American warfighter, and their newest effort brings student veterans into the energy workforce to conquer tomorrow's energy challenges today. Every time we're doing research or technology development, I've always viewed that you need to connect this with the educational side. Many partners are working with ONR on the energy front, including San Diego State University. ONR recognized the value that we added and wanted us to become a partner with them and have really stepped forward in a very large way to provide opportunities for our students and also provide support for, for the university. So San Diego State University, the Troop to Engineer program, we have student veterans uh, recently out of the military and with a, a great technical background looking to uh, get a major in engineering and science. And we're partnered with uh, Office of Naval Research on, on a project uh, called ESTEP. Well, ESTEP stands for Energy Systems Technology Evaluation Program and it's a collaboration between three uh, Navy research organizations and the fourth uh, Office of Naval Research which provides the leadership direction and funding. Besides Spay War System Center Pacific we also have Naval Postgraduate School and Naval Engineering and Expeditionary Warfare Center working on these projects. San Diego State's Troops to Engineers program helps find the student veterans and ONR's ESTEP helps coordinate high-level, cutting-edge internships in the energy field working to help the warfighter of today and tomorrow. What it is is energy sustainability projects across the country looking on military installations to find ways to conserve energy. Currently I'm working with the ESTAP project to uh, try and analyze the entire power grid for Camp Pendleton to determine if uh, it's going to be feasible or beneficial for them to put solar panels or solar panel arrays in certain areas. The benefit of the ESTEP program and our partnership with Office of Naval Research is that it exposes students sometimes to an area of work that they might not have even considered. I first discovered Troops to Engineer my first semester here while taking a general studies course for veterans returning into school. And there I met Dr. Patricia Riley, who's the director of the program, and she helped land me an intern this summer at Port Wyneme Navy Base doing renewable energy. They're motivated. They have higher grade point averages, they graduate at higher rates, and uh, they bring to the campus just a sense of pride in the country. It seems like with the veterans, uh, with their maturity, um, and actually their experience in the battlefield, they are willing to put up with the vigorous work, and it seems like it's a great fit and produces great results so far. What we try to do is provide to the veterans a way to take the skills that they have accumulated through their entire military career and translate that into a very powerful resume. My experiences uh, with this program have been uh, amazing so far. I've gotten to do a lot of work that is applicable in my field and I feel like we're making a difference with the work we're doing. There's no better transition than an E-Step, um, you know, allowing veterans through fellowships to exercise again their, their engineering technical abilities along with actual engineering model-based applications. Since I started working with the Troops and Engineers program, I've realized that industry comes back and they, they ask for more veterans. Veterans and military people in general are, are very entrepreneurial. You send a group of Marines out to the desert with a box full of tools and tell them to build a runway. 
they figure out a way to do it. They make tremendous employees. The partnership between ONR's E-STEP, San Diego State University, and Spay War is a great opportunity for veterans. The Navy benefits from the internship of highly motivated and talented individuals supporting our Navy's energy and energy management research projects. Likewise, our returning veterans gain valuable experience working in their future career fields while they pursue their engineering degrees. This is a huge win-win for the Navy and our veterans. I would love to see this partnership between ONR and San Diego State University uh, continue. We'd love to see this partnership grow and I would love to see this partnership be duplicated across the nation. For our a range of other technology demonstration programs, if we can get other people to take a look at how we're doing the E-STEP program and using it as a training opportunity, not just a technology demonstration by contractors, will they start adopting some of the things that we put in place? then I think the model that we've created at least could be used to influence how all these other projects are done. For more information, please contact the Office of Naval Research at onr.navy.mil.